Hi guys, so I thought I would do a what did Mercedes buy this month? <laughs> I know I haven't been on here for a while, it's just October's like the busiest month for me, birthdays, and I got sick, and then there's just no. So I thought I would do some swatches of what I got. So yeah, let's get into this bad boy. So the first one we're going to talk about is Morphe. I only got three shadows, well, two shadows, so I'm waiting for the third one to come in. It took them so long to give me this palette. Like, I waited a very long time. And I'm still waiting for my third shadow, which has yet to come in the mail. Because I guess it's one of those high order ones, I guess. Whatever you want to say. But I got these two colors. I got this one. And I got this gray one. This one is like a foresty green with like gold flecks in it. And this is like an uh, average like gray color. Excuse my nail polish. I look atrocious. So the green one swatched. That's what it looks like. Mm. It's right after. This is a nice color. It's like a very nice greeny. very buttery. It's, it's very like a pewter, actually. It's green, but then you can like, if you like, move it back and forth, I guess you can say. It's like, comes off taupey even. But it's green, it has like goldish flex. I like it. Now the gray one, that's what that one looks like. And then, that's what it's swatched on the back of my hand. This one right here. And it's a nice, like, dark gray color. I want to n n say that the numbers are 78 and 79. 78 is the green color, and then 79 is the gray. But I don't know their name. So, yeah. That's that. If you hear random, like, heavily breathing, like, noises, that's my dog. She's sleeping right behind me. She feels the need to want to sleep behind me. So, yeah. Alright. <laughs> Dang. So then I got some stuff from Makeup Geek. This is the Gunmetal palette. The Z palette. And I bought this many. This many. So beautiful. I love the fact that it's not like the Morphe one where you can like put it in. This one's like open space. So you can pop it out easier. So the first one that I got is Beaches and Cream. Beaches and Cream. It looks like that. It's a nice, like, highlighter color. It's like this very soft, peachy white, if that makes any sense whatsoever. I like it. I like it. It's a very, it's, it's a peachy white, if you know what I'm saying. The next one I have is Creme Brulee. I think everyone has this color. Like, it's like the biggest staple from Makeup Geek that you could possibly get next to... Excuse me. Um, Coco Bear and there's another one. I probably have it. And then Frappe. Yep, I have that one. So this is what that looks like. And then it's right underneath. And it's a nice pale nude color. It's beautiful. You can use that as a transition color. If you want to go for a more pinky look or even like a soft warm look, you can use that as a crease to buff that in. It's a nice color. The next color I have is Frappe, which is a nice warm brown. And it's beautiful, honestly. I have this in my crease right now. And it's a nice, you can't even like... It's a really beautiful color. It's warm. It's warm enough to warm up your face. You know what I'm saying? It's a nice crease color. Alright. The next color I have is what I have all over my lids. I don't think you can really tell. But it's called Pretentious. And it's a beautiful... Let's try that way. Okay, that's much better, don't you think? I think so. But it's a nice 
through like it's a deep gold color deep brownish gold color if you know what I'm saying it's a nice fall color I like it I like it a lot the next color I have is I want to say cosmopolitan I think this is the cosmopolitan yes it is it's cosmopolitan why did I look like that when I said that <laughs> And it's such a beautiful color. Like, guys. That's what, that's literally just, you saw that? It was, and then, it's so pretty, don't you think? I love it. I love it. It's a beautiful, beautiful, goldy, pink color. I love it. I did this look with this once with uh, a few of the colors I'm going to mention later on. Well, and a few. And it came out lovely. So lovely. Let me just wipe that off. Okay. Alright. And the next color I have is this gray color and it's called graphite. It's a it's like a light gray. I used this to go out to a club once for my sister's birthday. And it's gray, but when you swatch it, it's it comes off blue. Like a, a gray blue. I hope I'm saying this just as sweet. Like, do you see that? Like, it looks gray on camera, but it, to me, it, it has it's gray with a slight hint of blue in it. I like it. And then if you like use Fix Plus or what I have is the Elf. Um, what is it? Makeup and lock or lock and set something. I have it in here. Oh, great. It's called the Makeup Lock and Seal. It's that. It came off, like, on its own, it's a nice color. It comes off lighter than when I swatched it. But with that, with either Fix Plus or even eye drops or whatever you use to intensify your eyeshadows, that will look amazing. It gives off such a nice color. So, that's what I have. Alright, the next one I have is Envy, and everyone talks about this shadow because it's so beautiful. It's such a nice foresty green. Home at, like, come on, guys. Come on. And this is not even doing it justice. It looks like it's black, but it's not. It's a beautiful dark hunter green with blue flecks in it. Like, it's beautiful. Oh my god, it's so gorgeous. So gorgeous. Like, oh, I want to do an eyeshadow look with this, like a smoky green black shadow. I love Mega Geek. Oh my god, I love Mega Geek. I love it, I love it. Okay, so the next four, I can count, the next four shadows I have, this one is called Cupcake. And it's a nice nude pink. It looks almost as if I put, um, creme brulee? No, not creme brulee. Nah, never mind. But it's such a nice pink color. You can use this, like, if you want to do, like, more of a berry look. Like a berry, like, purpley, plummy look. You can use this as your transition color to really, like, fade it in. It's such a nice color. The next color I have is called Last Dance. And this is a nice purple color. Like a berry purple color. That's what that looks like. And it's so, like, it comes, it's coming off like a, like a uh, brown. But it's a really nice purple color. Like a deep purple. But not as deep, you know what I'm saying? It has its browns in it. The next color I have is Burlesque. This is a beautiful berry color. Like, oh my god. It has these browns in it. This is... What is that? <laughs> last Dance. Okay, this is Last Dance. And this is Burlesque. And it's 
you could tell that this one's a lighter berry color than this one. This is a stronger. It has more browns in it than this one does. This one has like a lighter brown to it. Last, but certainly not least, I have Bitten. This is like a very well-renowned, like everyone should have this berry color in their life. Like it's a berry. It has browns in it, it has its berries in it, and it's so beautiful. Like, oh, uh, like that's what it looks like. It's so beautiful. Oh, uh, like those four combined, like that. Those four that I just showed you, you can use that. Use that all as a a, a nice berry smoky eye look, and it will look beautiful because they all transition well with each other. Layering them on. Buff it all out. What? You look fabulous. Alright, so that's from Make a Geek. This is La Bella Carousel from Too Faced. And it looks like this. And it comes with two bronzers and two blushes. Four eyeshadows. And then it comes with like four eyeshadow like thingies. And then a little mascara, which is the Better Than Sex, Sex Mascara, which is my favorite one. So, and then it comes with this, like, little booklet thing for you to, like, do, like, eyeshadow looks if you're not really sure, like this, and then, and stuff to pair it all, you know what I'm saying. Alright, so, this is the eyeshadow. And you can, like, if you don't want to keep this all to yourself, like I am. You can give this off because it says to and from. It's like a little holiday thing that they have. Alright, so the first one I have is, has a little, you know, the carousel with the pony and all that. And then when you open it up, it has four eyeshadows. So it has this one right here, this nice green one, this silvery one, and then this white. The black one underneath the first color was Santa's boots. This one's Christmas tree. This one's Tin Soldier, and this is Frost. Now, let me get some swatches for you guys. So this is one swatch, two swatch, three swatch, four. <laughs> and that's what it all looks like. Isn't that beautiful? Like, this is so beautiful. This is a nice metallic gray. I like it. And this green one, oh my god, you can really pair that with uh, Envy. Focus. It would look nice with Envy, honestly. Remember, mm -hmm. remember. So that's this first one. Now the next one I have is La Belle Cat Carousel, and it has a blush and a bronzer. This is Sun Bunny Dark, and this is Luminous Peach. Let me get some swatches for you guys. And that's what those two look like. This is a really nice peachy color, and this one is a nice bronze color, only the thing with that one is, is that they have the other one, the other uh, blush and bronzer, like, little set, is the um, Milk Char Chocolate Soleil, and it didn't give me as much pigmentation as I expected it to be. I have this combination on my cheek, I don't think you can tell, but the Luminous che uh, Peach and the Sun Bunny Dark. I have to warm up my face and stuff like that, and I really like this combination. I really liked how they paired the blush and the bronzer with this set. The next one I have is another little bunny, or not a bunny, a horse carousel thing. And this one is Sugar Plum Fairy. This one is Boxes and Bows, right? Nude Beach. And then the last one is Nutcracker. So this is the four one, and then I'm gonna give you swatches. So we're gonna go one swatch, two swatch, three swatch, four. Mm. Nude Beach came off a little chalky, but you know, and this is a nice color. This is Nude Beach. It like streaked a little bit. Boxes and Bows actually has like the same similar look to NARS Orgasm. A little bit, but a little bit more pigmented. I like this purple one. 
very well. The next one is La Belle Car Carousel, with the purple version of it. And this one has the other blush and bronzer, like I said. And it has Who's Your Poppy and Chocolate Soleil. I thought it was milk chocolate for some reason, but it's Chocolate Soleil. Now this one didn't have that much pigmentation. Like I had to literally go like this and then that swipe. So you see Chocolate Soleil and this is Who's Your Poppy. I mean, you had to really like, I had to really like get, rub my finger in that to get some type of pigmentation. And nobody has time for that when you're getting, doing a bronzer. Like, granted, you don't want to be too bronzed up, but still, I want some type of color on my face. I don't need time to be like, with my my brush, like, hello, where's the bronzer? So yeah, that's it. I've noticed that all the labellas with the ones with the words on it are the brush and blonde bronzers. Why am I saying bronzers? And the horse carousel looking ones are all the eyeshadows. So the last but not least, this is more like a warmer little collection one. The other one's like cooler tones and then the random like, hey. <laughs> but they have shimmers and one like the top one is always a matte color and the rest are shimmers. So this one's Yule Log Hot Chocolate Angel Hair and Tough Suede. So let's zoom on that. I'm get just some swatches. So this is Yule Log Hot Chocolate Angel Hair and I ain't even got anything for. This is nice. This would be a nice chocolate. smoky eye look. I keep saying smoky eye looks, but I don't know. Like, I really like this. So that's that. Focus on my fingers. Focus on the fingers. Meh. Alright. So that's what that one looks like. So yeah. <coughs> Dying. What? So that's what from Too Faced I got. I can't really swatch you the uh, the eye uh the mascara, but you know what I'm saying. Like it's mascara. I really like. But yeah. So we have. I'm sorry. Three eyeshadows from the little things like a three shadow. Then you have two bronzers and then two bronzers and two blushes and then the mascara. I really like their names, honestly. Like, it's very Christmassy. I like it. I like it a lot. So, yeah. Last but not least, I got... Oh my god, I can't count. Five lipsticks. Four from Kat Von D. And then one from NARS. The NARS one I have on my lips right now. And that's called Aubrey. Or Audrey. Audrey. It's not Aubrey. I'm going to call it Aubrey. And seeing as I already have it on my lips. Oh my god. I'm trying to fix it. Okay. So this one's Aubrey. Audrey. Aubrey. Audrey. Aubrey. Audrey. Aubrey. Okay. So that's what it looks like. It's a beautiful, beautiful color. And. Can't. Okay. So that's one swipe, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, do you see that? Sweet Jesus. Lord. I like that. <laughs> Alright, so that is NARS. The one thing I got from NARS, the Audacious collection. This is Kat Von D, and this one is Prayer. The all, okay, funny story. So I got these all on my sister's birthday. We went to Sephora. I was like, hey, you can go and get whatever you want. I'll buy it for you, whatever. And I went to Kat Von D's lipstick collection because I, I love her eyeliner. So I was like, you know what? Let me get some lipsticks because my best friend has the, the black one. I think it's called Slayer. Yeah. And she's like in love with that one. 
And I was looking at Homegirl because I really, really love Homegirl. And then I saw Nikki Tutorials use that lipstick on a, I, uh, like a look she did. And I'll link it down below. Oh my god. And I was like, yes. But I always have dark colors. So I was like, you know what? Let me get, you know, some nudes maybe. Some a little bit of pinky, darker colors. And then I saw Prayer. And I was like, nah. So this is Prayer. I love her packaging though, like, stop it. One swipe, ladies and gentlemen. Ready? Ready? It's drying. I do have to say about that. Like, as soon as I swiped, I was like, Aah. But that's what it looks like. It's a darker cranberry color. I can't really describe colors, and you will see that. But I'll try my darndest. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, the next color I have is Cathedral. And this is a nice brown nude. And that's that. It's really really cute oh back to my story so I went to the section and I have Pinterest and if you don't follow me you should I'm gonna link it down below and I remember repinning something with swatches of all the lipsticks on some girls lips and I was like "Ooh, let me see and I was like yep I want that one I want this one I want this one I want this one and I got four and I was like Mercedes calm yourself you don't need all this so I got the four that I really, really thought were just like absolutely gorgeous on this girl's lips. And one of those is Thin Lizzy. This is the third one. And I did not expect it to be sparkly like it is. Like, I don't think you can tell. But can you see that sparkly? I didn't expect that. Like, I saw it and I was like, yeah. So the swatch, and I was like, oh, this is nice, and then, it's a nice reddish orange color, and that's what's going to come off on camera, and it's a nice festive color, like a festive holiday color, like if you want to play it up, go simple on the eye, wing eyeliner, and then go with this, and it will look beautiful, but, mm, I don't know yet. I'm still contemplating on if I should keep that. And last but certainly not least is Vampira. Vampira. It looks like this. I can't help myself with these dark colors. I'm like, oh lord. And it's a nice chocolate color. Lied. It's a nice cranberry color, but it looks chocolate in the thing. Thank you. See? It's a nice color. A nice, nice color. And it's like this one. It's this one right here. It's a beautiful color. Beautiful, beautiful color. It's not as deep as... What was this one? Prayer. I thought it would be deeper, but it's not. It's more reddish cranberry than... No. This one has more brown to it, whereas this one has more red to it. Red purple to it. So it's totally different colors, but they're so freaking amazing. Oh my god. But yeah, guys, I hope you like this video. I know I keep saying I'm going to keep coming back, and then I just go MIA, and then I come back, and then MIA. But I got my hair done, so I'll be back. <laughs> like if you did, and subscribe if you haven't, and comment down below which product you want to see me use to make a look or maybe you recommend something for me I will totally buy it but yeah guys I hope you like this video bye I'm gonna finish watching Harry Potter Harry Potter troll in the dungeon troll okay thought you already know
she hasn't t put her tongue out in a very long time since she was a baby, so.